This tutorial will explain how to manually add an image to a report. At the end of the tutorial, an example of using a pipeline script to add images to a report will be shown. There is also a YouTube tutorial which describes how to create this pipeline script. By opening the Creating Report Tutorial CMO file, it can be seen that some items have already been added to the report. In this tutorial, two images will be added to page 3 of this report. Before exporting the image, go to the Workspace tab and set the active file as the file that will be exported. Set the frame to be exported and set the camera perspective as desired by panning, zooming, and rotating the 3D viewer. Right-click within the 3D viewer and modify the 3D animation view options. Turn off the lab axis, set the background color to white, Turn off the targets, landmarks, and segment coordinate system. The image is now ready to be exported. Go to File, Export Animation Frame to Image and enter the export file name. Now rotate the 3D view of the skeleton to an AP view. Go to File, Export Animation Frame to Image, and enter the export file name. Once the images have been exported, go to page 3 of the report. Set the item to Add as Image and browse the sagittal image just exported. Make sure the column and row numbers are set to 1, while the page number is set to 3. Now add the AP image, but make sure the row number is set to 2. Make sure to return the 3D animation view options back to the original setting. A pipeline script may be created to automate the process just shown. In this simple example, we open the CMO file without images and open the pipeline script. Select Execute to run the script and a pop-up dialog will appear. The user will be prompted to select which C3D file images will be exported from and the desired frame to be exported. When the script is finished, select OK and go to the report. The images have now been added to the report.